Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, Simon here. Just want to be able to give you a, a quick guide on how to create your account in um, Interbooks. Okay, the new student program. I've realized that most people have a challenge with that, so that's why I wanted to be able to show you how you can be able to go about it. So, basically, uh, this uh, the Interbooks are uh, the platform that you're creating accounts for right now is what uh, the merchants will have access to, uh, or maybe our customers will have access to. So, this is it's supposed to be able to give you a quick overview of how the account will look like. So with that, I'm going to jump um, to my browser. Okay, so this is the link actually. Um, this is the link. So what I'll do, I'll just... Uh, so you copy this link or you can be able to just click it on WhatsApp. It was shared in the group. So you can be able to click on this link here. So just click on that. And that will be able to take me to my browser. Okay, so that takes me to my browser. And um, if I have an account, but I want to do that, this is meant to be able to help you to actually create an account. So um, what I'll do is that there's this option of, of join, okay? So you click on this option of, of join, right? So click on that. Now, if you have not created an account on this platform, like you're creating an account for the very first time, uh, don't fill in your details here, okay? Whatever emails or password that you've got, since you don't have an account yet, please do not fill your details here. Uh, if you're coming to the platform for the very first time, what you need to do is to create an account, all right? So click on create an account. Then it gives you the option. Now, the areas which are marked with, with uh, red are mandatory areas, okay? So what you need to do is that uh, just come here and fill in your details. Now, uh, you can see that your name is mandatory, last name, email address, and the same thing will be for the for your customers uh, when they are when they are creating their accounts. But the areas which are not marked with red, those areas are not mandatory. Okay. So what I'll do is just go ahead and be able to fill in my details here. I can be able to use alias. Okay, Simon, for example. Then I'll be able to uh, use my email address. Uh, remember that you can be able to use your Gmail, uh, uh, your Gmail email address. That's perfectly okay. Alias Simon. Just pick one of my emails. Um, okay. Then you choose a password. Now this password is something that you can be able to remember. Okay. It does not have to be like a password that you've been given by the company or anything like that. This is your personal uh, password. Okay. So just go ahead and be able to put my password here. Uh, but it should be something that you can be able to remember. You, you that's after you can use your name, your phone number, whatever that you can be able to remember for this account. Okay. So I'll just go ahead and be able to use that. Um, just give me one second. Okay. So now you, you see I've got that. So I'll be able to put my phone number here. Okay. Uh, your country phone number, I think that should be able to work well. Right. Uh, so I got that already. Address, you see, it's not necessary. You can be able to put or just leave it out. Then under country, click on this. Uh, I'll be able to choose maybe uh, Kenya. Uh, right there. So can I come there? If you're in Norway, you can choose that. Whether in Mozambique, you can be able to pick that. Then state, uh, just choose Kenya. Don't worry about anything. Just use the options that are given to you. Then just use what is given, right? County, just choose what is given to you. Don't don't try to sweat it, right? Then this, choose zero. Then tick on this, right? And then create an account. So there you go. Like I've got... Like within that short time, I've been able to create my account and it's now active. Now remember that um, unless you want to be able to upgrade for the f like for 24 hours, you have access to all the books. So if you can be able to click on this, I'll be able to say like browse. Okay. Or browse and then I can be able to come to health or mental health and nutrition. Just click on this. Uh, the idea is that you get familiar with this stuff. So I can just say that um, power, of, of, uh, power of physical exercise, I can have to cut. Okay. Just say okay. Um, so basically, this is just to be able to give you an overview of how the program works. Uh, so you can be able to have access to all the books, and uh, I think there's an option to be able to add, like, let's say, read the book. Um, 
So there you go. Like I've got the book, I've got all the title, the, 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 the headings. You can actually be able to just click on this and you can actually read the book. Uh, and this is available for the first like uh, 24 hours after you've signed up just to be able to test the program. And even if you're a customer, uh, if you try this, actually you're going to like the content very much. Uh, and then after that, to be able to, you need to be able to upgrade. But for students, you don't need to upgrade uh, because your work is to be able to promote. So guys, I just thought I should be able to do that for you, for you to be able to see how it works. So uh, after 24 hours, you won't be able to have access, but just try to navigate, navigate the platform and see how it works. Just look at the different books. Okay. Uh, yeah. So maybe I'll be able to create another video just to be able to show you the ins and out. But this is basically how you can be able to have access. So I'll just click back here. Uh, and make sure that I get back to where I'm supposed to be. Okay. So you see, I've got access to all the books and that's available to me for, for the next like, you know, 24 hours or something. So, um, I'll just try to get back here. So I'll come back here. Okay. So I, I have access to these ones again. So I can be able to come back here and um, just click on this and now uh, keep looking. Now for, for students, remember you don't need to upgrade anything. There is the subscription, but here's a student you're supposed to promote. So you don't need to activate anything. Uh, it's our customers that are supposed to activate with the, with the monthly program. So you can see on my cart, I've got this book here, but of course you don't need to pay anything. Now both the coupon codes, uh, I think I'll be able to do another video, but the coupon codes, uh, Mr. Carlos uploaded them on Facebook. So you can be able to go to Facebook, but it will be provided to you. So it's not a big deal, but if you need, I can be able to create a short video about that. So that's basically it. I hope this really helps you, uh, to be able to sort it out and be able to have access, but I think it's a great platform and it's good to be able to help most of us. So, uh, Depending on languages, you can actually be able to choose lang uh, English, French, Portuguese, and Spanish. So it's a great platform and uh, just go around, look at the books that are available. Um, my library, you look at this, uh, the book that I had, actually, I can be able to find it there. Uh, yeah, maybe I just come uh, browse. And... Yeah, so I can be able to check through this. If I'm looking for kids' books or spiritual books, I can be able to click on nutrition. And when customers subscribe, they'll actually have access to all these books for free, like for the yearly subscription. And uh, yeah, so that's it, guys. In case I've got any questions, just post it and I'll be able to, to do another video on that.